Okay, B6 number 8, the directions are to graph. Okay, so we're going to graph this in a minute, but first we need to find two points on the graph, okay? So I'm going to find the intercepts, that is, I'm going to organize my work like this. I'm going to put a zero there and a zero there. That means that when x is zero, I'm going to find y, I'm going to graph it. And then when y is zero, I'm going to find x, I'm going to graph, I'm going to plot those two points and then draw a line through them, okay? So, this just helps me organize my work, this little chart. So I'm going to take 0 and plug it in for x. So let's do that. Okay, that's an x value of 0. So negative 2 times 0 is 0, and I'm left with 3y equals 8. And I divide by 3, and I get 8 thirds. Okay, y is 8 thirds when x is 0. I'm going to write 8 thirds as a mixed number so I can graph it a little bit easier. 2 and 1 third. Okay, now I'm going to do the same thing for y. I'm going to plug y in for 0, or 0 in for y and find x. So, I get that. That's an 8. 3 times 0 is 0. I'm left with negative 2x equals 8. Divide by negative 2. And I get 8 divided by negative 2, negative 4. Okay, so come over here and graph these two points. That is 0, 2, and a third. About right there. About a third of the way between 1 and, or 2 and 3. Negative 4, 0 is about right there. That's my negative 4, 0. That is 0, 2, and 1 third. And now I'm done. When I graph my line, I just can draw a line through those two points. And I'm done. Okay. So, keep doing your homework. Um, remember, you have to do your homework in order to pass this course.